Okay guys, today I'm going to show you on how to just like basically spawn um s to start your game just in a single player kind of way. Um so um but basically first of all what you want to do um you actually have to create um a C sharp script and now it's just called menu. Okay. So now in the C sharp script um, I'm going to pause the menu so um I can just get the script ready. Um but just for you guys just so long the script um you can go and watch my other video um on how to make a basic menu i'm going to leave that in the description and then now i'm going to finish the script and i'll be back soon hey guys i'm back and um just to show you um what i've just done in the couple of minutes um just while i was pausing the video i'm um, just to say um that i've just done all of this um so if you want to pause the video and just copy this down, I wouldn't mind. Um, okay, I'm not going to explain it because in the other video, um, I explain it. So um, so I'm um, just copy down the parts that it is. So now you can pause it right here and right here. Okay. So now let me just show you what it is done. Okay, it has made the start game and the and these two missions. Okay, so now when we click these buttons, they do nothing. Okay, so now quickly we're gonna save the scene, and we're just gonna call it menu. Okay, make sure we want to save it into the correct spot, and we are. Okay, and there it is. Okay, so now we're gonna create a new scene, and now it's just created terrain out of it. So game object create other terrain. Let's set the terrain to be negative one, negative one. Okay, now let's quickly drag our camera onto the the terrain, and now I'm quickly just gonna add a texture onto the terrain, so it's gonna at least look a little bit better. Add texture. Oh damn it! Uh, well, let's add it. So now it's gonna it's gonna let's see it's just what we see, and yeah so now we've got this now let's just quickly save our scene and we're just going to call it mission one okay make sure that you spell it whatever you want it to be so now capital m i dot two s's and yeah okay i'm happy with that save it okay so now in mission one okay so now in the script of ours we want to create, let's just minimize all of this stuff okay, so now in here just like the private string, we want to just copy this quickly control C to control V and now instead of saying current menu, we just say current mission or map, whatever you prefer so now um, on the void start, let's say current mission is going to equal mission 1 so now um, mission 1 we are going to have to set um, which is our mission which is going to be our current mission so on start game um, we're going to say um, We're going to say mm, current mission is going to equal mission one. Okay. So what is this? What is this telling us? This is just telling us. Oh damn! I did something wrong. Oh damn it! Uh, mission one. Okay. What this is telling us is it's telling us what m which mission so um but just trying to think now um so we're also going to need a start so let's control c control v just quickly and now let's say start start game 
at spot 40 which is gonna be 100 and then now let's say um if we need an if statement current mission is um is mission one then now we have to say um application application dot load level it's gonna be called um mission one add a semicolon at the end and now let's go else okay if current mission is um mission two so then now we have to say um oh damn it ah wrong one then we have to say application dot load level is mission two now let's add our s semicolon at the end and now let's just see if I think I forgot out something. Um, let's just quickly see what if I forgot out something. Um, string to bool um, what is it? Forty-eight. I oh, said so current menu, not current mission. Okay, let's save this. Now let's see. Did I save it? Yes, I did. Why is it still reporting problems? Um, current mission. to bool um okay let's just quickly do this save Ugh. did that do a difference yes no no it has one problem um if current mission is oh come on there we go I can finally get rid of all of this and just do the same here now there should be no problems whatsoever and now let's create another one a let's save the scene okay and now let's create a new scene so now let's create a new terrain just quickly just to tell the difference main camera just move him up here and over here just to tell the difference and now let's save this one as ah save project save scene as two okay so now let's save this now let's go to menu and now let's quickly see um oh i also see that i forgot out something um so we have to set what our missions are um, so we're going to have to have a public string 
called mission one and now let's duplicate this control C control V and now let's just make this mission two so now let's save that okay save any last now let's now this should be a different style here okay so now over here we're gonna have to say which mission is which so in our mission one and okay so now in here I hope that this works because I did this a couple seconds ago mission one start game okay so as we could see it could not be loaded because it is not added into the build settings so let's close this let's go to build settings now let's now let's add menu let's add mission one and mission two let's close this quickly let's quickly test before we build mission one start game and there we go now it works and now just to show that it works mission two start game and currently it is not working so um have i changed it start game um in it should work um but at least now you know how to spawn a menu you can just get rid of this whole entire else if because currently it is not working but now just just for hind's sake you at least know how to make a menu and at least just script it to work so start game mission one as you can see it's not loading start game it's loading and it has loaded so now that's just a basic way on it just for your menu to work I um, hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial please leave a like comment and just for more other views like easy tutorials like this one please subscribe to my channel for the latest updates and feed and um, hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial this is Ethan Luck signing off